just wears defenses down. I just get the feeling people get tired of squaring up to Marshawn Lynch. Yeah. And look at this. Those Skittles. <laughs> Go get some Skittles if you're a young back and see what they do for you. Give me some Skittles. This whole Skittles thing is very bizarre. It was bizarre, but pretty funny. When it comes to food and sports, well, there is one clip that I have seen more times than any other. During the NHL lockout, we showed this clip of Gary Bettman eating a slice of pizza at least 1,000 times, maybe 2,000 times. Oh, the commish sure likes his slice. He's really thinking about it. There he goes, wipes his mouth. Now he thinks, maybe I'll split it in half. Oh, no, I'm going to fold it. New, oh, New York style. He's a folder. Top 10 food moments. Enjoy. I think you all should try one of these muffins, because these muffins are real good. I I'm telling you, this right here is the best muffin I had in a long, long while. Wait, is that Jose? I think that's Jose Batista. Hello? Are you eating a hot dog? No. Dude, you're eating a hot dog two hours before the game? He makes enough money. He's stealing popcorn from that little kid. He hit him on the other shoulder. He doesn't make enough money to buy his own popcorn. I'll tell you what, only a kid's gonna go for that sound dog. After batting practice, we saw Omar Vizquel, and it looked like he was the lonely guy. And then we realized that uh, he had ordered some chow. <laughs> he looked up. We got a big chuckle. He said, okay, we got the order right. And this is for my teammates. Sometimes it's the fans stealing the show by how they eat. Big Smooth, come in here, buddy. I can handle that. Yes, sir. There we go, Big Smooth. <laughs> Have I got the sandwich for you. I'm here with George Coots here from D.C. And the burger joint has given us this nine-pound burger. Now, all George has to do before the end of the third quarter is to eat this whole thing. How's it going so far? Not that good. <laughs> Get your popcorn. The words Terrell Owens made famous, turning it into a touchdown celebration against the Packers. Owens wasn't the first to celebrate with popcorn, though. R.J. Soward, the former Argonaut, had that honor. But the Alouettes got the last laugh, winning the Eastern Final. Yankees twins New York reporter Kimberly Jones pulls out a pork chop, prompting this fan to try it out. Wait, can no that way. guy just bit it? I, I, I didn't bite it. Oh, that's just disgusting. Look at this guy. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Kim's had that for three innings. You know how cold that is? Turn around and slap the guy in the Yankee <laughs> uniform. Back at the New York Jets, and you can eat a hot dog on the sideline. During the last TV timeout, Mark Sanchez is trying his best to hide a hot dog and eat it. Oh, wow. As this foul ball goes into the seats at Fenway, watch the fan in the Patriots jacket. Oh. <laughs> what was that that came flying in? He got hit with some type of sub sandwich or something. Here comes a pizza. See it? <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh. Highly unnecessary. Oh, some pizza. Our sympathy going to our fan of the game. Young man had a, a little taste of ice cream, and we've all had it happen. That, that terrible headache you get when you've had something too cold. We used to call those Mr. Misty headaches. Sports Center Top 10 is brought to you by Mr. Lou, where you'll never need an appointment to get a fast, warranty-approved oil change. Ready for a change?